Now on to that update of that accident that shocked the nation. Learning activities at Kenyatta University have been suspended for the next three days following Monday's road accident that involved the university, university bus in which 11 students were killed. The university management says that it has made that decision in honor of the departed souls. Meanwhile, over 20 students and staff were Tuesday airlifted to Nairobi for intensive care. Joseph Wahungu reports. Changed up but lucky to be alive. Students and lecturers who survived Monday's horror accident in Maungu are recounting the moments that led to the carnage. Uh, Eleven people died on impact. Kenyatta University Vice Chancellor Paul Wainaina visited the injured in Voi on Tuesday, even as the school announced that the learning had been suspended for three days in memory of those who perished on Monday. The accident in Maungu came on a day when five people lost their lives in Bomet in yet another road carnage. Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen says the runaway accidents are unacceptable. To enforce road safety laws, the Transport Cabinet Secretary on Tuesday announced that the National Transport and Safety Authority will make a comeback on Kenyan roads. He said the retesting of all public service and heavy commercial drivers will be implemented without delay. Among other measures announced by Murkomen are the medical testing of drivers and a crackdown on unroadworthy vehicles. For Prime Edition, I'm Joseph Wahungu.